The Apple Watch has Apple Pay, like on the iPhone, but how does that work exactly? It's a little bit different. On the iPhone, there's Touch ID, which helps authenticate payments. Here, you double click a side button and Apple Pay comes up. You bring it near the contactless terminal and that's it, you pay for things. Now, there is a option to activate a passcode on this, which I would recommend. If you take this off your wrist, you're gonna have to enter that passcode in order to use Apple Pay. But other than that, you can use this to pay for things even when not connected to the iPhone. Now, it's not gonna use the same credit card that's on file on your iPhone. It's gonna set up completely separately. And the idea is security. It's setting up a separate virtual credit card number on this, so if somebody does take your watch and you have to cancel that number out, it won't affect Apple Pay on your iPhone and it won't affect your credit card. That's how Apple Pay works. It's pretty simple and it worked on our vending machine. I'm Scott Stein at CNET with Apple Pay on the Apple Watch.